Hello everyone, I'm the Solar Gamer, and welcome back to The Walking Dead, Episode 2. Now, here in America, we are celebrating Labor Day. If this video does come out on Labor Day, relax. Watch this video, then, uh, I don't know, hang out with your family, do whatever you need to do. Despite the name, you don't actually have to, you know, do labor. Um, so, uh, yeah, just kick back, relax. Even if you're in another country, just, you know, just don't go to work. Stay at home. Say it's an American holiday thing, you know. They'll, they'll let you, I think. <laughs> um, all right, let's, uh, let's get into this. Hey, get up. Mm. Oh, I'm itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet Perfect. your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm, uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of fence. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Duck? Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? That's a nope. valuable treat lately. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hammers. Oh, jeez! But he makes up for it with enthusiasm. He is not good with children. <laughs> the word is, you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Um, maybe. maybe. We'll see how things shake out with this Herschel guy. <laughs> Good luck with that. He's a hard ass. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, <laughs> I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. Okay, cool. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Alright, so it looks like I'm free walking here. I have the walkie-talkie, I don't know how to access that yet. Be sure to check in with everyone you've met so far. Okay. You having a nice time with Katya Clementine? Yeah. Is that our name? I never got that. He seems like an alright dude. Except he's not good with children. It's not the most reliable pickup in the world, but it gets the job done. Hey there, uh, Kenny. What's your plan, buddy? So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots, and the National Guard will do its thing. Well, on the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. Well, if there's a, a zombie chasing you, I don't think you have a choice. Okay, so I learned about Kenny's boat. I don't know how that's going to you know, become a factor later on, but... uh. How's your son? How's your son doing? Good, I think. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. Okay. And I guess the last option... Need, need any, any help? help? No, I think I got it. Do okay. you need any help? What do you mean? Well, I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? I have no idea. Well, I don't, but... Nah, nah, no, no kids. Would have liked one, then. You know. See ya. <laughs> what an awkward conversation. This is a very small farm. Compared to what is um, shown in the TV series. Do you uh, think this thing will keep him out? Not yet. I'm planning on coming back through on a fortification pass, if you will. We'll lock this place up good. Let's hope so. Sean's still working on that fence. Yes, he is. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that'd sure speed things up. Be sure to do that for you. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. 
I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Was the boy one of the walkers? I don't even know. He was either attacking the guy or asking for help. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh, uh... Yeah. I had to shoot one. I could shoot one. Maybe. If it were far away. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? My brother and parents are in Macon. I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. I think I just cut three of them. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. There we go. Good. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Oh, what a coincidence. There he is. You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> oh, that's weird. How you doing, Duck? Good. I'm going to drive the tractor. The foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. <laughs> okay, you have fun now. Doop to do. All right, fine. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I got a ride. I got a ride, and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. <laughs> Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was I brought up to, yes. I do. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? Probably dead, but, uh, I'll say this. My parents are in Macon with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Why do you think I'm a pedophile? <laughs> yeah, I was looking for help in her house. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? What is it? What is it? I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. Oh, and I'd start checking the attitude, friend. What? Go! I'll get my gun! Uh-oh. No! Oh, come on, Doc. Alright, this is probably gonna be one of those, you know... Uh, I gotta choose the kid. I have to choose the kid. I have to. It's a moral decision. Sorry, Sean. Uh, what? Okay. Oh my god. Please help me, please. No, damn it. Oh, good god. Oh, I think I made the wrong choice. I think Duck would have been fine. Oh no. Sucks so bad. 
get out. Get the fuck out of here! Oh, shit. I'm sorry. Sorry? Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. And you, you didn't even try to help. I was worried about the boy. Look at him. But you weren't worried about that. Please, just go. Get out and never come back. <sighs> well, say thank you. I'm serious? You've got that ride to make it if you want it. Uh, uh. What the hell? Well, this is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. friendly trucks run out of gas yeah, that's a good idea Fuck. yeah you're smart huh oh look at you We're trapped. <sighs> are you serious the boy you know <sighs> who is that and who are you oh my god We can't take risks like this. And we can't just let people die, either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. We have kids with us. I see one little girl. What? What is it? I... I have to pee. Oh, <laughs> I'll go out there again in a second. I bet you would. In a minute, Clem. They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join them then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. She's not wrong. They took a risk. Yes, we did. And we appreciate it. Now let's settle down. Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. Ah. Uh. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Oh, uh, he's Over dying my first. Dead body. We'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! We, what do we do about this guy? I say we kill him. Dad, it's just a boy. It's... Lily, I'll handle this. But your heart, Dad. Kick his ass. You need to calm down. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Everyone, chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. This is getting shut out of control! And you, shut the fuck up. Oh they my god! Us, and they will get in here. And none of this will fucking matter. Oh. But right now, we're shut about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's Give him a bitten. sedative. That's how you turn. <sighs> He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. All right. Oh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting eaten alive. Sit down. Well, that's it. You're gonna whoop me? <laughs> you and what <one> homo? <laughs> <This one. laughs> that's good. Little boy. Oh. Before you eat your mommy, you can watch your dad get his nose broken. I'm gonna kill him, cat. Just worry about duck. Lee. Yeah? There's someone in there. Oh no. It's just locked. 
keys behind the counter. No, 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 no. Probably. Well, I didn't tell her to do that. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, when she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. It's a little boy. I think we can handle it. A little boy? He'll be an uncontrollable man-eater. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him oh, out Oh, this now. is tense. Uh, I'll stop him. No! You don't touch that boy! You don't touch anybody! I've got a little girl I'm trying to protect in here, too. You wanna get violent, you old fuck? Well, come on! You better have a plan to kill me, though, because it's me before <laughs> anyone else in here! Oh, I knew that was gonna happen. What was that? No, 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 no. Come on, come on, get the hell up. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh god. Oh. Man. You okay? Just great, thanks. I'm a little shaken up. What about me? <laughs> That's not gonna work. They can smell ya. We're gonna get in. Shut up. What was that? Is that the military? I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and the Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was. Uh, uh, Dad! Uh, oh, heart attack. Um. What's wrong with it? It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. Okay. We'll get in there somehow. Thank you so much. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. And Clementine. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Who are Agreed. you? And I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. Okay. Yeah, that'd be great. Damn, that'd be great. Well, it's got to get done. Plus, I'm quick, and I know Macon. But Wait a minute. Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you if won't that's leave. That's who I think cool. it is. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you, what's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Boss. Now get him those pills. Yeah, I think that might be Glenn. Central High Tech State. Paper's a week old. Feels like years. It's not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. Okay. Oh, it's a candy bar. Okay. I still don't know how to use all this stuff. Sorry, we're closed. Well, that's fantastic. Another candy bar. How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad. That didn't help. Neither did you. What's wrong with him? He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. 
I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, he does have a big temper. He's got a temper. Ah, fuck you. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't mean it. <laughs> yes, he does. It's just that... Yeah? We've got kids here. Family. He and I are a family. I'm just saying some people can't handle a temper like that. Hell, barely seems like you can. It's just his way. Don't make him the reason everything's screwed. I didn't say that. Where's her mom? Savannah, I think. Oh, you guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Oh. I heard an answering message. They were in Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Well, she's lucky to have you. That's right. First person doesn't think I'm a pedophile. Yay! You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force Base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UGA. Was anyone here besides the zombie in the bathroom? Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. What was that all about? Did you know anybody here? Yeah, the owners, they were, uh, we were close. I'm sorry. Uh -oh. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. Okay, well, that sucks. What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up, walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, Jesus. We need to stick together and get through this. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. You want a candy bar? It's not much, but here. You sure? Yeah. You're under quite a bit of stress. Thanks. That's, uh, really sweet. Don't mention it. You better remember that I gave you that candy bar. I don't know what this candy bar does, but hopefully something good, so... We can't let anything happen to Ducky. Yeah. No, hun. Okay. Well, he got us kicked off the farm, so... Haley, you really gave that old man hell. Yeah. We got pushed, you know? You don't have to tell me. I was ready to tear the man's head off. <laughs> anyway, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. How's Duck? How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. No kidding. How's she doing? Her family is dead. I don't know that. She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's just a little girl, Ken. What were you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so... We ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? Oh. That's right. Where, Where are they? Should we go looking for them? Was that the old couple? Oh, no. They, uh, own this place. They, uh, pulled some bodies out of the office before we got here. They're, uh gone. Oh, oh, sweetie. Chad. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah, they did. That sucks. I didn't know that. I just figured it was just a friend of the family or something. Well, now I know why he was shocked. Are you guys all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. Lee, you got a second? Sure. back on Herschel's farm. Yeah? We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, you know? It happened pretty fast. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves over We it. killed that boy. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad things happened. We didn't make a choice that killed Sean. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, 
When things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. I guess. Console? Trying to let it go. Oh, console. Hmm. to get back to Fort Lauderdale. Have a candy bar. Just, it's not much, but here, for the boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's sweet, Lee. Cool. Anybody else in here? Where's Clementine? No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead guards. <laughs> oh, no. Yep. That was definitely them. That sucks. What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work though. Here, let me have a look. Okay, because I know a lot about radios. Uh. Do you have any better? Nope, no batteries. There That's no batteries fine. For this thing. What now? Uh, you know that there are no batteries in that thing. Yeah, of course. I, I mean, yeah. No. I can try to find some. <laughs> Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. Where is she from again? Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Uh, yeah, let's have a look. Sure. Let's go have a look around. Cool. And we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring them back this way with any unnecessary noises. Agreed. Okay, cool. Jesus. Yep. This town is infested. Just eat. As far as I can tell, that's all they care about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. I can't reach that brick. Yes, you can. But he can. Uh, alright, let's look around first. <laughs> Too bad we don't have a way to come out here and watch the news. Would be nice to know what's going on elsewhere. Atlanta's in rough shape, and that's all I know. What else we got? Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up, and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Man, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. <laughs> Look at the one trapped over there. Better go uh, us, huh? Oh no. Oh shit. What? Do you know that guy? It's his brother. Kind of, he has a familiar face. Maybe. Uh, you're from around here, huh? Could be anybody, you know? I they start rotting and get all chewed up and... Shut up, dog. Look at the uniform, though. He could have worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket. It would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys. If we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. I'll see what I can find. You know him. Just... <sighs> Take the brick. Can't reach that brick. Yes, you can. Don't be a baby. Fine, go back Let's inside. Head back inside. Okay. There's nothing else out here. What is that? What did I just pick up? Oh, a battery. Cool. Hey there. Hi. Any word from Glenn? Yeah, it is Glenn. Nothing. Okay. Is he okay? Yeah, 
I think so. You're doing a good job. Can I, uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. I'll see about that. So, um... Are you okay? What? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I just, uh... I'm good. That's good. <laughs> yeah, I, I think so. Uh, being good is good, despite the circumstances. Yep. Well, sit tight. Okay. Yeah, have a candy bar. It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. That's right, I took care of her. Now let's go find that last battery. We can actually go in here. I can't. I can't think about them in here. Why did you come in here? How you doing? Okay. Everyone out there seem all right to you? Yeah. Well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah. We'll keep an eye on him. There was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. I know. But you stopped it. Yeah, I did. Can you do that more? <laughs> well, I'm not gonna go looking for him. I mean, get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. Plywood. Let's move it. What's that? What's that? This was my dad's cane. He <laughs> zip around here on it from time to time. <laughs> was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you with your hat. My dad gave it to me. See, dad's just smart like that. We ought to clear this door for when we find the keys. Yep. I ought to clear a path to opening that door. Okay, cool. But first, let's, uh... Take a look around. There's a photo of Find anything? It's a photo of the family who owned this place. Might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. What? You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. Oh. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? No. I've been sticking to first names for a reason. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Thank you. Thanks. Don't worry about it. I didn't know he killed, or, uh, was tried for killing somebody. First aid kit. Or, that's what I thought they accused him of. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Luckily? My parents came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. I don't see another battery in here. Damn it. This door leads to the back alley. Must be in the pharmacy, so we're gonna have to, uh, clear this out of the way and... I don't know. Better get this door clear, huh? 
find a Can way to I get help? the keys. Sure. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. <sighs> How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. <laughs> How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. Okay, here we go. Good. Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? What do your parents do? My mom is a doctor, and my dad is an engineer. Those are good jobs. What's your job? I, uh, teach history and writing and things like that. Like, um, social studies? Yeah, like that. <laughs> you didn't answer my question. Uh... All right, a little further. <sighs> Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? I wouldn't blame them. Why? Did you fight? I fight with my mom sometimes. We didn't fight. We just didn't talk for a while. Look, my family's gone and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I'm not a bad guy, okay? Things happen and we didn't talk much after that. My parents don't talk to me when I get in trouble. I can relate. Uh-oh. Are you okay? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. I'll find you a bandage. I know just where to look. I kept the remote for that thing in here someplace. Ah, oh, there's the remote. Not a battery, but it's a remote. It's the remote to my dad's TV. Lee? Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll find us. They'll, uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. We should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Okay. Let's repair this, this cut of yours. Let's have a look at that finger. Ow. It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. We can. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. How's your thing? It's okay. Thanks for fixing it. You're welcome. All right, I'm let's get out of here. I'm gonna keep looking around. Come okay. on. Come on. Let's go. Move your butt. Let's get out of this room. Lots of memories of my dead family. Wanna head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Lee? Yeah? You're not bad, right? I, uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? No, he wasn't. Oh. Was he bad? He was. Is he admitting to it? Where is that battery? Hey there. Uh, this is Glenn, and uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie or whatever? This is Lee. What's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and... Well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I uh, uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group. And a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn. We're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, alright? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. Okay. We'll hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. And you got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. 
Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. Cool. Well, I was hoping to find some batteries, but if, uh... We want to go save Glenn, that works too. This battery should fit the radio. Great, thanks. How we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Let's have a look. Let's have a look around. Okay. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Yes, this brick. I can't reach that brick. Doesn't matter if you can reach it, he can. Damn it. Have this remote then. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Let's just hope the power is still on. You can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. <laughs> he has a use after all. Well fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? Oh god, look at him. That got a few of them to take notice. But not enough. Open sesame. <laughs> that won't work. I was kidding. It's universal, but uh, not that universal. <laughs> <I'm not done. laughs> Can't reach that brick. Take the damn brick and throw it at the TVs and make a large explosion or something. Good God. You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. <laughs> I'm still looking for batteries for that thing. Thanks. I appreciate it. You ready to head out? You ready to head out? You got it. You? Yeah. Let's go. All right. Hello there. How are you? Did you see that? I sure did. Be ready to shoot. Guys! Oh man, I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn! Right then wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas, and then up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her, and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. Uh oh. I tried to convince her I wasn't, and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A couple almost got me, and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her, with or without you. Think about if it was you. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. <laughs> okay, this is the plan. We don't know how hard it's going to be to get her out of that room. Yeah, it's boarded up. <laughs> So we have to kill every one of them in here. Quietly. Noise attracts these things. Now let's have a look around. Oh man. She's eating something. Oh god, no no no. Close. Oof. There's one back there trying to get into a room, but I didn't see anyone actually in there. There's a pillow over there. That's about as far as I got when it came to supply gathering. I might have an idea for it. Well, I don't. But you can grab it. Good luck smothering them to death. <laughs> That's not really what I have in mind. We can hide by that RV if we're quiet and keep our heads down. We could. Let's take a look over here. We can hide by that pickup. The girl's behind that door. Those two seem to be on the scent. 
RV or pickup truck? RV, definitely. Yeah, it's right by a zombie, but I think we can do it. Let's go. Okay, let's head back to that wall. I'm not sure I can take them both out myself, even if I had a weapon. Probably gonna get caught for this. Let's go back. Quickly, quickly now. Come on. Come on. Pickup truck it is. They really wanna get into that room. <gasps> no 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 no. We can do something with that car, I bet. If it weren't for that fellow lurking near the front. Oh, a screwdriver. I think I found a pretty damn good way to stop these guys quietly. Now we just have to get it quietly. Punch it! No, that's not right. Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. Alright. <laughs> Was sick. <laughs> cool. That worked like a charm. What is in here that oh the clutch? All right. <laughs> Spark plug. You should hold on to that. Could come in handy. I prefer cover that can't just roll away. Well, we're gonna have to uh, move with it. I, I think that's the plan, anyways. Or not. It was awesome. <laughs> Okay, now we're back here for some reason. Yeah, look at that. Wait. Let me see the spark plug. Uh, the porcelain oh. inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. Okay. Uh oh. Are you kidding me? That made a lot of noise. Oh well. Not complaining. Take the, the screwdriver. That could scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Not yet. Now! Oh god. There we go. Right in the face. Whoa, 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 whoa. Lee, get him! Nice. Thanks for having my back. For sure. Okay. Pretty good. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> Dude, where'd your weapon go? Into that ice pick sized hole. <laughs> Holy shit. It's cool. Now we've got this. Are you two done? Alright. Two the more. That should help. The fire axe. Let's go. Do 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 do. Going up the stairs. Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay, we'll be right behind you. This is gonna be fun. Little zombie friends. Eh, 
And you too. Rat. Rat. The hell. Hello in there. We're here to help. Please just go away. Let's go, guys. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. Please. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. All right. Stop, just stop. I'm coming out. You're hurt. Oh, God. Uh -oh. I, I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you, I said go away. I'm bit. But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? Glenn. I don't <laughs> want that. It's not Christian. Please, just leave me. Please go. What if you turn and follow us back to our group? I know, that was why I was locked away. I can't let this happen to me. You have a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? Give it to me. I can just, you know, end this, and then, and then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. Um, okay. Give it to her. What? You can't be serious. Do it. No! Then shoot her. Huh? I've seen what hell is like, and it's coming back as one of those things. Shoot her! Help her out here. You're insane! Do Just it! Just take this thing. That's right. Thank you so much. I know how terrible this must be. We can't watch this. Let's go. We can't go yet. What? Why not? Because somebody needs to pick up the gun. Can't leave it. You two go on. Okay. All right. I'm here with you. You're a good man. And there she goes. This is very emotional. The whole script. Where did they get the taxi or the the pizza thing? Oh boy. Everyone all right? Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine, and well, yeah, we're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Alright guys, so uh, as you can tell, it's very morally challenging, but I guess that's why they made this game. To test you. I hope you all enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and have a great Labor Day.